welcome to Profiting Forex Trading. I'm glad to come your way again. Uh, today, I want to show you a simple strategy on how to scalp the market on the lower time frame. Most uh, strategy I have uh, taught you all I've explained uh, in, on my channel, majorly that for 15 and uh, one hour a strategy but today i have come up with another a simple strategy for scapper a lot of people does not like uh, staying long in the market just to take a few pips five to ten pips and they are hot so i have developed a simple strategy that will help you to do that successfully okay let's move on to today's strategy but if you've not subscribed to my youtube channel kindly make sure you do so like my video and chat me up on my telegram group this strategy the indicator i'm going to use you can actually uh google it and uh, you are going to get it it is free uh let me add a symbol changer to my uh chat so that we'll be able to change uh, from one piece to another so you can add as many pairs as you want uh, let me for the purpose of this uh, uh, training let me use uh, all the pairs available for now so I have uh, paste my own my own piece here and uh, make sure you change this one to manual and uh, so time frame you can turn it off then I would like to change this to theory so that I can have three rows so once you are done just click ok and then here we have it then the indicator we are going to use generally uh, is TMA indicator this uh, type of TMA this one does not uh, uh, repaint but we just have to adjust the setting to fit into our trading uh, methodology all right let me add this to my chart right now just follow me closely and here is the indicator uh we are going to change the setting here just make sure you watch me closely the correct time frame we are going to change it because we want to scalp and I'm going to change it to 60 minutes and the, the half length I'm going to change it to 20 then the bounce deviation I'm going to change to 2.5 and uh, once you are done you can increase these these are the signals and the remaining ones are the bounce line so if you want it a bit you can uh, enlarge this okay once you are done just click okay now we have it on the chart and then just press ctrl g in order to remove the grid and the other thing we are going to do since i said this uh, strategy is for scalping then we are going to change our time frame to 15 or 5 minutes all depends uh, on you so and uh, you can use it you cannot use it higher than one hour time frame because I actually put it on a uh, 60 minute time frame. So it is better you use it on lower uh, time frame. And here is the setting. And the other indicator I actually wanted to add, which is not necessary, but you want additional confirmation, you can actually add this indicator. And the add indicator is normalized MOD. let me just try uh, add it it's normal nice uh, MACD and I'm going to adjust the settings these are the default setting but I want us to change this so 3 then the next one to 11 and the, this changes to 21 and the price you can leave it as zero and the color you might want to change it let's change this to red and the, uh, this add up to white okay 
so and uh, the level let's try and add the level so that we know when this actually change cross from a uh, minus to positive side now we have it right now okay now let me explain how to use this particular strategy this is us 30 and uh, it work well you can do without normalized MACD this TMA indicator with my adjusted setting will work well for scalper for scalper and if you want to scalp you can use only the TMA without considering the normalized uh, MACD signal so let's see what happened without uh, using it this star does not actually uh, repaint once you have it it's going to remain uh, there it's not going to change uh, this is not going to change it's going to remain at the level that once the candle close is going to remain it doesn't change and then when you look at this uh, uh, US 30 this is on 15 minutes uh, you find out that uh, whatever this thing actually give us signal the signal remains it doesn't change and then we are going to check the history but uh, with this strategy you must uh, have it at the back of your mind that the first uh, signal might not uh, give you the desired result that they take profit and uh, this uh, scalping uh, practice does not uh, use uh, uh, stop loss because uh, I will show you one or two examples that you understand what I'm trying to uh, explain now let's use uh, this particular one at this point we have uh, a set signal after the close of this candle we have a set signal here giving us uh, a set signal with this uh, a star giving us a set signal and uh, if you take a uh, you actually enter that trade you are going to get just like a 31 p which is still okay but uh, let's assume you are targeting higher pips and uh, this does not uh, deliver at that particular time and then uh, we have a, a pullback and this is the second one so if you place the second order for instance if you use 0 0.01 at this point you can decide to use the same lot size or you increase it either 0 0.01 or 0 0.02 at this point and uh, at this point once you place the second trade you are going to hit your target without uh, any uh, difficulty and then uh, here again the first one actually gave us our take profit and then uh, we have it here and we check this one again we have set signal and this one give us uh, a good uh, profit here is it again another sell and the uh, year is buy also at this point and uh, they actually deliver where and then uh, we need have uh, opposite signal at this point because it didn't touch the band so at this point also we have uh, a buy signal which didn't deliver if you are targeting uh, the middle uh, band of this but if you are taking only small piece you will have a uh, getting out of the uh, your trade but if not the second one is going to deliver uh, most of the time maximum you might not see more than theory before you actually uh, eat your uh, target for the day and here is the second one placing the order again then all the way we have a good right and here is another one another buy and the here is another set and uh, another uh, buy at the moment uh, let's try and check uh, other other pairs and see how it goes let's see good uh, because I know some people like uh, trading good also like I do so here is it again for a sell at this point this deliver also for a buy another sell another buy uh, and we have buy at this moment right now and if we check uh, other pairs let's check euro USD which I did I place order for this for a buy and uh, it's yet to deliver to so it went up above my entry point but it's yet to uh, deliver and uh, here is it again I will have enter another one from here but I did not because I was not uh, I didn't see it at that time so uh, this is how to use this particular strategy uh, most of the time I can 
are saying that this we deliver we actually deliver you can check the history it actually work well with this adjusted uh, like setting you will make more money scalping with this uh, tma if you follow the simple rule now now that we've used only the uh the tma without uh, considering the normalized macd now let's uh, put uh normalized macd in the picture and see how we can actually use it now the best way to use it is to wait for uh, this to cross above uh, zero level and turn to white for a buy at this point and then here again at this point for itself at this point and then uh, here again itself at this point that's why i said it is not actually necessary because this actually confirmed and it and uh, let's check where the first one didn't deliver let me check the us 30 again where the first uh, buy didn't or said didn't deliver here is it again okay now if you consider uh tma you will still be in the market you will have entered it so that's why i said there's no need of using this uh tma for double confirmation because it actually gave us signal also give us signal and at this point give us signal for a buy also so you can use uh the tma alone with this adjusted setting is going to work well so this is how to actually use this particular strategy it work well for scalping the adjusted setting so if you want me to give you this in the kettle just make sure you chat me up on my telegram group do make sure you subscribe to my youtube channel till i come your will again I remain your friend and fellow trader, Joe. Bye.